Hey guys, and welcome to another sort of Let's Try gameplay series. So, this game fascinated me as soon as I saw it. This game is called Foxhole. So, what this is, it's kind of a top-down, isometric, massively multiplayer online war game. I know, massive mouthful. <laughs> um, the new update that just came out is called World Conquest. So, basically what it used to be is, you join a server and you kind of fight this persistent, massive war over loads of different maps. Now, it's it's one kind of massive server and loads of different wars. So, uh, I'm going to join the Colonials. That sounds cool. It's 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 no real war, but I think it is kind of a real war. So, I'm going to join the Colonials. Now, I have never played this before. So, think of this as episode one of a gameplay series. That's also my first impressions, if you get what I mean. Um, I watched a couple of videos of it, so I'm, but I'm just li literally going to be messing around. The phenomenal thing about this is, is that you, you, you do everything. You do. You don't just fight. You like build f FOBs. You s salvage scraps to build trucks to use those trucks to move scraps and guns and ammo up to the front lines and go back and deliver. And loads of people love the um the back and forward. Just going back and forth. So, there, so there's the controls. It's pretty straightforward. Um, okay. Map. Yeah. Perfect. All right. So WASD to run. So already the game runs smooth as balls. Um, I'm not exactly sure what the fuck to do here. So I think we go to basic training. E to view monument. Yeah, I don't need to do that. So this is kind of similar to like PUBG, but you can build everything like, oh no, you need a hammer to build. Okay. The travel map. Okay. So here's where you travel. There's skirmishes over here. And then there's skirmish here. So what I'm going to do is. Okay. So there, as you can see here, that's the way it works. So I can't really do anything but skirmishes. So we're the colonial. So I'm going to skirmish islands. Satchel, what's this? Trench. Okay, yeah, I'll try this. Travel over. So we'll try a skirmish and we'll see what that's like. And if I enjoy it, I'll continue it. Same as I did with H1Z1. Because I really enjoyed making that. But this game looks really interesting. And I'm going to be following its development really close. So here we go. Press M. There's your home base. You get geared. Weapons are stockpiled at bases. Rebuild and hold towns. Claim and hold all town bases to win the war. So these wars last days. I mean, like, days. You could you could fight this battle now, and I could come back in a week or a couple of days, and this video will be the exact same. Backpack, so I have a pistol. So there's my pistol. Oh, that's my hammer. Pistol. Okay, reload my pistol. So as you can see, turn down, or top down, isometric. Use hammer to repair. E to use refinery. So you refine it to metal, and then you use those metals to build FOBs. But there's people who bring it up, like drive, like just make it their mission to drive. It's just phenomenal. Um, okay. So I guess we're going to want to go this way. We're going to go try to go this way, okay? So we'll have a look and see what's going on. Okay, so these guys are building something. I'll help them, I think, if I can. I don't know if I'm helping them, to be honest. Yeah, maybe I'm maybe I am helping them. I've no idea. I know it says out of materials, but so we're gonna want to get the fuck out of here quickly. Get down. Oh, I'm bleeding. Am I? Shit. You are being treated. Okay, so a medic. Okay, that's cool. That's pretty awesome. Thank you. Can I say thank you? See, I'm gonna try to be as friendly as possible in this because. Everyone, like, you saw that guy was on me, like, white on rice. He he helped me big time. Shit. Critically wounded. Shit, shit, shit. Medic. Medic. <laughs> No, ah, I'm bleeding out. Come on, medic. Medic, no. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, well, that's that's all right. Wait. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, never mind. Anyway, that was weird, but that was interesting. So, spawn a home base. We'll go back to home base. Uh, I'm going to go. 
First of all, I'm going to need a proper weapon. So I'm going to find out how to get a weapon. Two. Is it tab? No, it's not tab. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. See, I don't think anyone's bringing weapons here. Ah, right, here we go. See. See what the guys do. They bring, like, weapons and shit over. Don't know what that was. Oh, shit. Shit. I got lit the fuck up. <laughs> oh, shit. I forgot to reload. <laughs> Respawn available in 30 seconds. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> so, as you can see, it's kind of tough. And it's there is a tough learning curve. But my, my general first impressions are I like it. I like the way... You can already see everybody working together. I like that. This new update is something that everyone's exploring. It only came out on the 15th of March, so five days ago. And it, it kind of, it did what like the Elder Scrolls Online did. It, it brought every server together into one giant persistent war. Kind of like Planetside 2. That would be the closest thing I can think of. So, get my fucking gun out. Reload this time. Run my ass over here. Fuck, I'm getting lit the fuck up here. <laughs> oh, God. They're right there. Okay, you know what? I'm going to abandon that. I'm going to try a different... Um, going to give a different skirmish a shot because the night time was kind of boring and there wasn't that many people there. So that's basically the best description. It's a massively multiplayer game where you work with hundreds of players to shape the outcome of a persistent online war. And it's in early access. It is 19.99, And from my from my very early impressions, it is worth the buy. Definitely. So I highly recommend you guys pick it up if you're interested. So I will get into another game and I'll be back to you in one sec. Okay, so. We just joined another match. You know, I'm going to try to get in this. Can I get in this? No, can I? Okay, I can't get in that shit. I was really hoping I could get in that. That'd be so cool. Okay, so I should have... No, I do not have a weapon. Okay, fuck. I, try, I tried to take a weapon with me, but uh, it didn't work. A proper weapon, like so. I reload my pistol. Don't want to forget to do that. Uh, first of all, the map. We're gonna want to go this way, so we're gonna gonna go left. I gotta say, this game is actually really good looking. It, it looks, it has, I, I'd say a Fortnite -y kind of feel, but better, kind of more realistic. I like it. I like the the art style. It's it's fucking it's gorgeous looking, and it runs like butter, so that's even better. So I must say, I really enjoy this. Anyway, I'll see when we get somewhere. Okay. So, gonna try place an order. I'm not sure how this works. I'm not sure if it's gonna work, but I can try place an order for a carbine. So I need 120 metal. Not enough materials. Okay. But I think there's weapons coming. I have no idea, though. Hop the wall. Hop the wall. But yeah, guys, I'll post a link to this in the de in the description below. Because this is awful. Uh, this Sorry, this is awesome, I meant to say. I'll see where uh, the team are going, or where the guys are going here. So, Magnum. Shit. Tried to get in, that would have been awesome. So he's ferrying people back and forth between front lines. So what I'll do is I'll just wait here. And when he gets back, I'll be back with you guys in a sec. Okay, so I've managed to make a gun here. Um, this, you assemble them from the home base. And that's about it, I think. Okay. Oh wait, actually, we're gonna need to make more weapons or more. Um, oh no, we have ammo. Wonder should I get more just in case? Yeah, you know what? I'll get more just in case. And then just a little bit more. Should do the trick. Okay, so. I have managed to hitch a ride in one of the kind of transport vehicles. This guy has loaded up with metal and he is transporting. So this guy, 
loves his logistics, as do most people in this game. He's just going to deliver metal, go back, pick up more metal, go back, deliver more metal, and that's that's what he's going to do, and he's going to love it. And people do love that. They love this part of the game. They like everyone contributing that little bit, because this bit of metal can be used to build a forward operating base, more weapons, maybe a truck or a tank or even that far. And that's that's how awesome it is. That's why I like the aspect of this game and the idea of it. So I'm definitely going to be playing more of this. But for now, we will see how um, we will see how how far we get up here. He drives like an idiot, but still, like you can rebuild houses and buildings, like like that garrison house, that that butchered house there. You can rebuild that. So let's see where we are. We're going to Idolo, so that's where everyone seems to be going. They're defending Idolo, as you can see here. So everyone is really awesome, really friendly in this. I must say. The good thing is you can lock your vehicles because I know a couple of months ago people were um, complaining about people stealing vehicles and now you can lock them. I don't know if you can lock them and then log off like you used to be able to. Okay, here we are. I got a rifle. I am ready to rock. So I'm going to follow these guys because uh, they seem to know what they're doing. I see this guy is just ferrying people back and forth. So I'm going to follow this guy here. What is this guy doing? Fuck. Oh, this thing. Oh, this is building. Oh, cool. That's so cool. So he must be building a full-on building. They're getting shirts. I don't know what that means. We just fortify it. So basically what we're doing is we're fortifying it. This is locked. So I think somebody logged off and locked it, which is really dick move kind of to do. Okay, an SMG. Yes, please. So what you do is you must just load this thing up with metal. Set a spawn point. Perfect. And SMG rounds. Maybe one more SMG round. Okay, backpack. Okay. Got a nice SMG here, yeah. Reload that bad boy. <laughs> okay, storage box. This is really cool. I, I really like this. Now, the thing is, with the map, the skirmishes are only at the moment because what happens is they end the conquest, the big world conquest. They end that, and it's over to, for another day and a half, I think. Then the big world map starts. So I'll probably do another video when that properly starts because... That's probably going to be the most interesting part of it. So this guy is in a foxhole. Can I get in? Can I get in? There's a guy building another foxhole out there. Can I hop this? No. Okay. I can use it, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bother. So somebody stockpiled Arcadia, which is over here. No. I think it's somewhere in here. I don't know how you get in these foxholes. Oh, Q, okay. Oh, that's so cool. That is so fucking cool. <laughs> oh, that is so awesome. Okay, so this place is really well fortified. So as you see, we have a, like a medic base. This guy is just going around fucking fortifying the shit out of everything. Let's go check out this building. Excuse me. Oh, you have to climb in, do you? Okay. This is pretty cool. What can I climb? Let's sort of shoot out the window. Probably not. Not really. No. Okay. Perfect. Okay. That's fair enough. Damn. I gotta say this game is fun. Okay, guys. So, I'm gonna end the video there. Um, it's just for the moment. Uh, what I'll probably do is either closely after or reasonably soon after I'll upload the second video because I plan on continuing to do this so uh if you guys enjoyed this or want to see more like same with h1z1 just let me know and i'll happily do it but for now i'll see you guys soon so thank you guys so much for watching